It is dangerous to say God has spoken when God has not spoken. There's a new sickness that is about to come out. Is it a virus or is what? Viewers, our God is still the same yesterday, today and forevermore. And he has never stopped talking. Below are some of the prophecies that were given by the man of God, Prophet A. Boris, in regards to a deadly sickness. On the 3rd of September 2017, the man of God, Prophet A. Boris, gave a prophecy concerning a sickness that is about to come to existence, which is more than HIV. He went further to say that this sickness will start from the Asian continent and will later on spread onto other countries and that people will wonder where the sickness is coming from. He further said that even doctors will give the sickness two names. That is, they will give a first name and later on a second name. He said the world is coming to an end and that Christians should be on their guard. Concerning this sickness, the man of God said that some people would prefer to have HIV. I, I said something last time. I said there's a new sickness that is about to come out. It's more than HIV. There's a new sickness that is about to come out. It's more than HIV. So please pray and be on your guard. It's more than HIV. You prefer HIV plus, 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 more than this sickness. So I'm saying this into the whole world. There's a new, is it a virus or is what? It's a new sickness that wants to come out. More than HIV. More than HIV. More than HIV. Hmm? More than HIV. It will start from Asian continent. Asia. This Asian site. Please, it will start from there. A new sickness. More than HIV. More than HIV. People will wonder where it's coming from, how it's coming from. Doctors, I, I don't know. They will give the sickness two names. The sickness will have two names. They will give the first name. Later on again, they will give the second name. The world is coming to an end. That is why all these things are happening like that. Be on your guard and pray. More than HIV. More than HIV. More than, more than. You know, I like to reveal you things before time. So that you, 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 you know how to do. You know how to walk. When you say you are a Christian, it means you are the light. You must know what is in front. Yeah. How can you be moving on the same platform with those who are not Christian? You are blind, they are blind. No. So, new sickness. More than HIV. Some people will be praying for HIV to come more to them. People will be even preferring HIV. HIV will be preferred, preferred 100 times more than this sickness. So, it will start from Asia continent there. This. So, that is what I'm seeing. So, we should pray for the Asian continent so that God will protect them, guard them. Because if we start from there, it will spread and cross and cross and move and move and move. Before you realize, it's everywhere. It's everywhere. And I'm saying this in just the same way as I said the one of Ebola, 2013. This is how I'm saying this one again. This new one will be stronger. Two months is too great for you to live. When you contact this one, that is all. That is all. You will not pay low. You will be fat. You will be the same as you are, but the thing kills you. The thing will kill you. On the 26th of August, 2018, the man of God went ahead to prophesy concerning this same sickness he prophesied about on the 3rd of September, 2017. He said that 
this sickness will come to existence and that people will pray to have HIV. It will kill hundreds of people at the same moment and at the same time. Let's watch and hear what he said. There's another sickness that is about to be exposed. Exposed by which means this issue of this sickness, I will keep part of it to myself. There's a sickness that will come out. <laughs> you will pray to have HIV than to have it. So it will start, it will blow out. It will kill hundreds of people at the same moment, at the same time. I mean, you pray to have HIV than to have that kind of sickness. It will be the worst. Sixteen months after the last prophecy that was given here at the temple of the Lord's church by the man of God, Prophet A. Boris, there was news of a new disease in the month of December 2019. And in 2020, it became a pandemic, the coronavirus, with the first cases seen in china the whole world was taken by surprise there's a new sickness that wants to come out it will start from asian continent asia this asian side china has identified the cause of the mysterious new virus there's a new is it a virus or is what is it a virus or is what? Coronavirus. Coronavirus. A rapidly spreading virus called COVID-19. Doctors, I, I don't know. They will give the sickness two names. The sickness will have two names. They will give the first name. Later on again, they will give the second name. Coronavirus. Coronavirus. A rapidly spreading virus called COVID-19. As the news spreads of China's mystery illness, so too does the unknown virus. The outbreak has been linked to a seafood market in the Chinese city of Wuhan. It will start from Asian continent. Asia, this Asian side. This is part of an all-out government effort to contain the virus and growing public anger at the authorities' failure to act sooner. We're deeply concerned both by the alarming levels of spread and severity the number of countries affected is rising fast. Iran and areas of northern Italy now no-go zones. From this evening, I must give the British people a very simple instruction. You must stay at home. A dramatic surge in cases of that deadly mystery virus from China. Do you think it's going to keep spreading? I think that it, it is heading towards becoming a pandemic, yes. This is the first pandemic cause. In a dizzying few hours, the World Health Organization declares COVID-19 a pandemic. Tonight, with the U.S. now leading the world in the highest number of people testing positive for coronavirus, surpassing Italy and China, hospitalizations doubling every four days now. Morgue space is filling up. This grim picture outside Bellevue Hospital, about a dozen of these refrigerator trucks lined up to hold the dead.
it will kill hundreds of people at the same moment at the same time This one will be stronger. Two months is too great for you to live. Why you contact this one? That is all. That is all. You will not pay low. You will be fat. You will be the same as you are, but the thing kills you. We're going to turn now to President Biden today, marking one million Americans lost to COVID-19. This as health officials warn that the crisis is far from over. Infections are rising across the nation and a growing number of COVID positive patients are now entering the hospital. Whit Johnson joins us now from hospital right here in New York City with that. Good morning, Whit. Robin, good morning to you. As President Biden commemorates the extraordinary loss of about a million Americans to COVID, health experts are looking forward. And the next steps in tackling this pandemic come with significant and immediate challenges. A new forecast used by the CDC shows hospitalizations and deaths are again expected to climb over the next four weeks. More than 1.5 million people around the world have died from COVID-19 since the pandemic began. About half of those have been in North America and Europe. So far, only about 53,000 deaths have been recorded in Africa. We start with some breaking news and the World Health Organization has just released a report estimating that 15 million deaths occurred globally due to the pandemic, around triple the current estimates. It has called the figures staggering. Our global health correspondent Naomi Grimley reports. In the first two years of the pandemic worldwide, it was thought around five and a half million people died from COVID. But because of patchy testing, poor record keeping in some parts of the world, and the fact that some people died of non-COVID causes during lockdowns, the World Health Organization now thinks that figure might be more like 15 million. There's another sickness that is about to be exposed. Exposed by which means this issue of this sickness, I will keep part of it to myself. Prophets are spirits in the hands of God. You are not restricted from using the name of the Lord to prophesy. But the issue is, let it come to pass. 